Uh, well, that's what about is and what can we do? Do we know what to do? Yes. What we know to do is to try to end the war. Wars can end in one of two ways, either by one side destroying the other or by negotiations. Uh, we prefer the first part. And you can be confident that it's not Russia that's going to be destroyed. Uh, Ukraine conceivably, unlikely, but conceivably could drive Russia out of Ukraine, but they're not going to destroy Russia. Mm -hmm. Russia can easily destroy Ukraine. And if you believe what respected Western commentators are saying, in Applebaum's and others, you can read them in the Atlantic Council and elsewhere, they're saying Russia is so crazy they could do anything. So therefore, we have to refuse negotiations and ensure that Russia de destroys U Ukraine. That's the logic. Hmm. Okay. Kind of interesting. And this is respected. Let's fight Russia to the last Ukrainian, as Ambassador Freeman describes their policy. Well, maybe it'll come to that, but there's a way out, negotiations. And as long as we refuse to participate in them, they're unlikely to get anywhere. And we might recall something else that Ambassador Freeman and others point out. The US is not just refusing negotiations, it's undermining them. The press won't report it. Yeah. But you can be sure that Russian intelligence looks at the uh, White House webpage and sees what's there. For example, they see our official policy of last September and last November. I've written about it, press won't report it, but the Russians certainly read it. And what they read is that the US is setting up an enhanced program for Ukraine to join NATO, is providing advanced military weapons. This is before the invasion providing an advanced military weapons to Ukraine, uh, joint military operations, uh, a training of uh, Ukrainian uh, specialists in advanced weapons aimed at Russia. Uh, simply imagine for a moment that this was happening in Mexico. What do you think the response would be? <laughs> well, Mexico would be vaporized, okay? Yeah. Because we have uh, security problems, but the Russians don't, you know? Yeah. Wow. It's, it's a lot to take in. And, you know, what I, what I really,